Operator. What do I do? Talk. <laughs> Chicago, Burlington, and Quincy. Yes, of course. Hold on a second, then I will connect you. I gotta look the number up. I'm sorry, I'm new. Gladwell, Sir Mac, Chavez. Oh, I didn't know we had any of those around here. <laughs> Burlington and Quincy. Sure, that's what it's called. I am looking at the train. It says it really big right on the. Found it. Okay. Just take that cable and plug it in right. Oh, I think it's ringing. Take as much time as you need. Doris? What? It's Dolores. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? This phone is a piece of shit. Is this the real road? Sitting on oh, the tracks okay. like my husband won't get off his ass. Give it a rest, Jesus. Anyway, Doris, as I was saying before, this Sunday when Pastor Ludovich was talking about Miss You Know Who, well, why else would his sermon turn so suddenly to the topic of infidelity? And that's all I'm saying. But while we were praying, Connie looked at Marco, who looked at Dan, who looked at me, and I said, What me? Who? Why me? She shouldn't be looking at someone whose marriage isn't a sham. Isn't that right, honey? Quack! See? My happy is clam. That's God's plan, Pastor Ludovic said. And Marco and Connie, I think that they should be friends. Because they should something in common, and that's Dan's thing. I'm so sorry, I need my glasses. I have glasses, but I never wear them. All these wires, they all look the same. Can't tell the difference when I compare them. Can you disconnect me? Chicago Central and Pacific? No, Burlington and Quincy! Shit! It's okay, just do it quickly. I'm in a hurry. Do you understand? Okay, okay, just hold on, ma'am. I'm doing the best that I can. Okay, you can do this. Just take the cable and plug it. Dolores? Yeah, it's Doris. Oh, God. No, no, it's your phone. I can hear you just fine. Besides, there's all these people and they're getting off this train. So what? So what? Damn it, they look suspicious. That one is black. Those are homosexuals. If you're reciting poetry as if they're intellectuals. That one has a guitar. I think that one is a Jew. Now he's one of the homosexuals and he has a guitar too. Oh. Dolores, how can I ignore this debauchery that's walking freely reeking like they're licking piss their heavens for God's sake? You think? I mean, who else takes a train to LA? Well, okay. I mean, it's obvious. Look how odd he is. If cleanliness is next to godliness, the god is in the devil's audience, if not his bed. I look at the top of his head. Is it dead? No, it's hair. Oh my god, it's everywhere. And hers is also everywhere. Dolores, I'm scared. You know, these temporary residents are future presidents, and my reticence to vote for Nixon isn't because he looks like a stink. Now let me tell you what I really think. Oh no, don't go. Let's try this one. Dolores said she stayed at home. Dolores? Coming pretty, she Mary Rich, they said. Oh, Chicago Burlington and Quincy Railroad Company. How may I help you? Oh, thank God! Well, that can't be it. No! Uh, hold on, my supervisor would like to speak with me. What's that? Apparently, I'm being fired. You're gonna have to call back. Wait, I can't call back. I'm in someone's store. Hello? So, did you get a hold of him? <laughs> 